Michael G. Keating here, your internet marketing mentor, providing you with internet marketing tips and tricks. Today it's Black Friday, the day after Thanksgiving obviously, and everyone's probably a little bit tired, pretty plump, and uh, feeling well fed, but that's okay. I wanted to take the time to tell you about a tool that I had created by the lovely people over at Fiverr. If you're not familiar with Fiverr, it's a gift and a curse. Some of the stuff that you'll get from there is very awesome and very useful. Some of the stuff is absolute junk, but most of the things that you buy start at $5. So it's definitely worth uh, checking out. I had somebody create an infographic embed code generator because what I noticed is a lot of people will focus on the production of the infographic, but they fail to actually do the distribution of that infographic or make their infographic more shareable for viewers and people that are checking it out. So to help you with that, I created this little tool. I'm going to walk you through how to use it, and um, hopefully you can take advantage of it and definitely help out your site's SEO. What I'm going to do is show you how to use the infographic embed code generator that I recently created. It's pretty straightforward, um, but I'm sure there will be some people out there that will benefit from this little tutorial. The best way to get there would be to go to the home page. Uh, so michaelgkeating.com. Once you're there, you can go over here to the top right and hover under um, hover of free tools and below that select infographic embed code generator. Once there, um, you'll see some text here. And it's more important to search engines. What really matters to you is right here. So you're going to enter the infographic details below and then once you fill out these fields, it'll generate a code for you what you'll do is grab this code put that on your website um, below or next to the infographic and then down here is what users will see so your infographic will um, precede this and then below that you'll see share this infographic so users can grab that and then share it on their blog and other you know sites that they're associated with what I wanted to do too is give all these files to you I'm big on you know creating things that are useful and then giving them away for free. Um, you know I want to see everyone succeed, so feel free to enter your email address and then you'll receive a zip of all the files. And I give you detailed instructions on how to install those on your site, so you can create this exact functionality um, and give it to your users as well. Okay, so I'm going to use an example here and I'm going to fill these out. So the first two fields here. Um, the embed box width and embed box height. These refer to this right here. So once it's on your site, um, that dictates how wide and how high that will be. So I recommend doing probably 500 and then um, embed height, probably do 100 to 200. I'll go right in the middle and do 150. Um, what I'll do here is enter the domain. Make sure that you do the full domain, uh, include the HTTP because you want this to um, generate a hyperlink for you. So I'm gonna do my domain. And then for post URL, wherever your infographic is posted, it obviously has to have a home. So um, ideally you'd want it to reside on your site or a site that you control. So you can add that URL here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab this one that I recently did, which is called the LinkedIn audience of a networking addict. I'm gonna post that URL here. Then for the infographic image URL, obviously you're gonna go to the post where the infographic resides, and then I'm gonna control click or right click depending upon the operating system you're using. Grab this URL, go back to the embed code uh, generator, plug that URL in here, and as you can see there's movement down here so it's generating the code for you. The infographic title, I would just put um, whatever you want really but for me I'm just gonna do you know the LinkedIn LinkedIn audience of a networking addict and that'll be the alt text what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab this code down here so I'll copy that I'm gonna go back to the URL where my infographic resides and as you can see right now um, there's just an infographic so people can't you know share that on their site um, I mean, they can with social buttons, but they can't actually grab it and share it and give me a link, but also give me some traffic through that link as well. So I'm going to edit the post. 
go down here I'm gonna take that copied code and paste it now what you'll see is I'll just update that and then I will view the post so now what you see here is you have the infographic and then down below you see the code so it says share this infographic on your site um, and then the infographic so if a user finds my infographic interesting and they want to share it they can come down here grab this code copy that and then they could place that on their site so what I'll do real quick is just create a new post just to show you what that would look like so if a user grabs that code we'll do testing infographic then I will paste the code here and we'll just do a preview we'll leave page So as you can see, the user, just by grabbing that code that you generated with the embed code generator, uh, a user can paste that onto their site. And what you'll have is you'll have your infographic sh show up. But then on top of that, you will have a link to your homepage. But then also, too, if you click it, there's a link back to your post as well. So you'll be getting a link to your homepage and a link to the post from that. So as you can see, it's pretty straightforward. Um, I definitely recommend using it for all the infographics on your site. You can definitely use it for other images as well. So um, normal photos or anything that you think users will benefit from. So please check it out. Um, be sure to use it. Grab the files, share it, and um, yeah, just start doing better marketing. All right? Hope you enjoy, and uh, let me know in the comments if you have any questions. All right?